Hello and welcome back to our channel. If you want to get slimmer inner thighs in only 7 days but you do not have time to work out and are looking for a quick 10 minute workout, this is a workout for you. It is a 10 minute inner thigh workout. So if you're a mom like me or just a busy person, come and do this workout with me. Let's start. You're gonna go into your back to a wall like I am or just not to a wall and you're gonna bring up your legs and you're gonna pulse down for one minute. Okay, let's go. So you're gonna bring your legs up and down. Up and down. Make sure you keep your core in. Flat on the floor and arms rested comfortably at your sides. You're gonna pulse up and down for one full minute. You're gonna feel your inner thighs burning. This workout is perfect to burn those thigh muscles, those adductors. You're doing great, my friends. This is the perfect exercise for us moms or for anyone who is looking for a quick workout to get slimmer thighs. Okay. Now you're gonna bounce them for one full minute. Let's go. Bounce. Bring them back. Bounce. Bring them back. Keep going for a full minute. If you wanted to really get those results, you have to finish the whole workout. One minute each exercise. Do this three times a week for the best results. I do suggest to give your thighs a break every other day. Because after today, your thighs will be sore tomorrow. And then you can repeat this um, workout again. In a, in a day. All right, keep it up. Post it. Post it. Post it. Keep it going, guys. You're doing great. Post it. You're doing fantastic. Okay, my friends. Now we're going to flip onto another side. All right, so what you're gonna do, you're gonna go onto your back like this. You're gonna put your legs into a frog position, so feet to feet like this, and you're gonna pulse for one full minute, okay? Let's go, and pulse. And you will really feel, you will really feel those inner thighs burning. Right, they're working like this. Good stuff. Keep it up. You can rest your arms on your belly or on the sides, whatever, whatever you prefer. But the, mo but the important part is to try and to bring your core, your tummy, pushing down onto the floor. So try not to arch like this because then it's going to be kind of beating the point and you're going to feel your back working too much. So just bring your core in and pulse your thighs. Pulse, pulse, pulse. To kind of keep in mind the core, just mentally squeeze your core. Keep your hands on your belly. That's how you're gonna remember to keep your core in. I find that it helps me to remember. Keep it going, keep it pumping, 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 pumping. Good stuff. Okay, now we're gonna go into a bridge position, yeah? And we're gonna put feet together and we're gonna pulse for one minute. Go. One, two, three, four, five, six. And what I want you to do, whew, my thighs are already sore, oh boy. What I want you to do is to really bring them in, 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 in. When you bring your thighs in, they're working more, in, in. In, in, but keep your feet in, keep your feet together. Whew. Bring them in, 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 keep them going in, good. 
keep them flopping like that. Good stuff, keep it up. Also, try to keep your booty elevated. Don't drop it like this, that's gonna be the effect. So really try to bring, keep your bum up, core together, and pump it. You're doing great. Okay, oh my God. Oh, my thighs are burning. Okay, now we're gonna change position and we're gonna do our side exercises. Okay, so you're gonna lie down and we're gonna start, I'm gonna put timer. We're gonna start with outer ovals. Okay, let's go. Squeeze your core. Keep it going, guys. Really turn that leg, circle it. Okay, good stuff. Now we're gonna go down and we're gonna do inner leg pumps. So, add one foot here and you're gonna pump it. Okay, go. And now if you pay attention to my toes, I curl my toes inward. I find that it makes it harder and more effective. Oh, my thighs go. Pump it, pump it, pump it. Keep the core in. You're doing great. When you bring that leg in, up, Squeeze the leg. Bring your leg with the thigh. Up, up, up. You're doing fantastic. Keep it going. Almost there. Okay, good stuff my friends. Now you're gonna bring leg to leg. Last exercise on this side, go. So what you're gonna do, you're gonna bring your bottom leg to the upper leg. Bottom to upper, bottom to upper. And here, you really have to squeeze your core because it does require a little bit of core workout to bring up that leg. So what you want to do, you want to squeeze that leg, squeeze the thigh, the inner thigh when you bring the leg up. So you bring up the leg with the inner thigh muscle, the adductor muscle. For 10 more seconds. You're doing fantastic, my friends. You're almost there. Keep it going. Squeeze that thigh. Bring it up. Okay, good stuff. Okay, now we're gonna flip positions. Okay. Start like that. We're gonna do our outer ovals. Let's go. And for one minute. Bring it in. In. 
I do have to warn you that your thighs will be sore tomorrow. So give yourself a break tomorrow with the inner thighs. Do another workout of mine, targeting the abs or the butt, but give your inner thighs a rest and your thighs a rest. And then after, and the day after you can repeat it. 15 more seconds. Don't give up, keep on going. You got it. You can do it, yes you can. If you're a mom like me, this is a perfect workout for us ladies. Okay, go to your side. And we're gonna pump it. Second last exercise, let's go guys. Pump it. Curl your toes inward, pump it. Pump it. You're almost there, my friends. We have one exercise left and you're done. You're one minute away from getting slimmer inner thighs in really only a week. You're gonna start seeing results in a week. All right, keep it going, pump it, pump it. Keep that core strong. Keep the core in, pump that leg, 15 seconds to go, let's go. You can do it as you can. Okay, last exercise. All right. And bring that leg in, bring it in. Keep that core in. Core in and bring the leg, bring the leg in. Bring the leg with the inner muscle, inner thigh muscle. Use your adductors here. Oh, guys, we're almost there. We're almost there. Oh, oh boy. Oh, my thighs are killing me. I don't know about you, but... Whew. Oh, I'm ready to finish. <laughs> All right, 16 seconds, push it. Push it, guys. Whew. 10 more seconds, let's go, you can do it. Yes, you can. Whew. Yes, we did it, guys. Okay. All right, my friends, you did it. Thank you so much for being here with me. If you like this workout, then you are going to like this workout in the end screen after this video. It is a booty workout, 10 minute 3D booty workout that I think you'll really enjoy to get a round booty and a butt lift. All right, so that is it. If you like this workout, please give it a thumbs up. And for more workouts like this to get slimmer inner thighs, flatten your tummy, get a bigger booty, go ahead and hit the subscribe button below.